Good morning, good morning. Happy Thursday. Hope you guys are having a wonderful morning. My morning started off pretty pretty good. Got the kids off to school. Mike and I did not make lunches last night. We try to do it at night and we didn't do it last night. So we were rushing to do that this morning. Got the kids off, took Gary on a walk. So yeah, it's been a pretty good morning. I have to apologize for being, well, I know a lot of y'all are gonna be like, you didn't have to apologize, but I, let me put it this way. I want to apologize for being a huge butthead yesterday. If you, if you missed it, I got on stories yesterday and basically said that I wish it was gonna like commit to raining because I love rainy days and rain hard today. Did not know Louisiana was getting hit by a hurricane. And so it came off so freaking insensitive. I deleted it. I told the lady, I go, thank you for telling me. I had no idea. So if you saw that and you were like, Jen, I deserve it. I'm so sorry. I know that those of you who have been here for a hot minute know my heart and know that if I'm looking like that, it's because I'm clueless and I have no idea what's going on. I gave up watching the news in the morning years back. I've got to pick up my room today. And so it puts me in this position. I'm taking a risk of not knowing what's going on. So just wanted to say I'm sorry because I felt like I wanted to very badly. Um, but anyways, hope you guys have a wonderful day, a wonderful Thursday. Um, today's a lot of, I don't know, kind of more boring things for me. I got some phone calls, some Zoom calls. Um, I got my girls, my tennis team playing tennis matches today. So I'm texting them trying to figure out how they did. I don't play in my first game until next week. So I'm excited to see how they did. But yeah, that's it. It's almost Friday. Tomorrow's Friday. We're almost there. These are actually not David Yerman. These are Amazon, but a lot of you already knew that, I'm sure. I want to say I paid like 20 bucks for the X one. That's the one that looks like David Yerman. And then the ones on the side, I want to say like eight to 10 bucks each. And I'll show you. I've had them since, hi, Gary. I've had them since last fall and there is zero discoloration. I'll show you the back side. But yeah, they're really cute. I always wear them on my left hand with my watch. It's kind of my little stack. Um, but yeah, no, these are a little inspired by your David Yerman pieces. Let me get into some sunlight here. So the back side, so here's the front. The back side is exactly the same. No discoloration at all, which is wild because I wear them a ton. Um, and then of course these don't because it's silver all the way around. So they keep up really, really well. You want to go outside again? I swear. This dog wants to go outside 24 seven and I have to stand out there and watch him pee. And then most of the time he doesn't have to pee. Let's play some bets. I bet he goes and lays in the sun. Let's see. Fluff what are you doing? Do you go potty? Go potty. This is what we do. We whine to come out here and just sniff air. So I ordered brass switch plates. I gotta do some touch up on that side of the paint. And it looks really good, matches the hardware that I've got in here. But I, I don't know, the white, the white rockers are bugging me. <laughs> I think it's because it's on a tan paint color. Whereas over here, it's on a white backsplash and it doesn't bother me. It looks pretty with the white rockers or the white switches. I, I really like it. Actually, the contrast matches the hardware perfectly. I love it. 
I'm trying to decide if I should switch the actual like rocker to be brass as well. What do you think, Gary? Gary? I was like, I was like are you good? Do you know you have 30 minutes? Are you kidding me? 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, yes.